In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Bing Copilot as a beginner. First, open your preferred browser by left clicking on the browser icon. Now, in the search bar, type copilot.microsoft.com and click enter to continue. This will take you to the official Bing Copilot website. The Bing Copilot interface is very beginner friendly. On the top right corner, you have a sign in button. Left click on it. Here you have two options. You can sign in with a personal account or with a personal office or school account. For this example, we will sign in using our personal account. Here on the right side of the page, you have multiple plugins to choose from. For example, by left clicking on the designer plugin, Bing will be customized so you can create any image you imagine. Let's give it a command. Simply left click the dialog box at the bottom of the page, give your command, and after typing your command, click enter. Bing Copilot will instantly give you the result using the designer plugin. Note that on a free account, you can only generate 30 images. Going back to the Copilot page, if you scroll down, you will see three distinct options. The leftmost one is creative. If you choose this one, Bing Copilot will give the most creative answer to your command. If you click the middle option, which is balanced, it will give a balanced answer to your command, and if you click the rightmost option, it will give you a super precise answer. Inside the command dialog box, you have an option to insert an image. If you click the blue icon on the left side of the dialog box, you can start a brand new topic instantly. If you scroll up to the top left corner, you have an option labeled Notebook. Left click on it. This will take you to a new page where you can type whatever is on your mind and on the right. Copilot will create your content for you.